Hey, Lazy Girl Approved fam. I'm back today with another wig review. This time is Seduction um, Galaxy. And the color is, I have two colors, Spectrum 1 and OBB pink purple before we do that just wanted to make a note to you guys don't be concerned about this bruise on my face I did not get in a fight um, it is a dental thing gone wrong I mean nothing went wrong everything went fine but um, later after the procedure my face was super swollen like I, I was a chipmunk and then this bruise formed so um, it's okay no fighting no uh, nothing I am I am fine stuff happens. I googled it. Apparently it does happen every once in a while. So there's that. Um, here she is. I got her on Elevate Styles for $26.88. Um, I did order her in the other styles, but she is not available yet. So I think what's happening is some of these sites are making an order with the manufacturer, putting the wigs, wigs up on the site, and then when they receive them, they don't get them all. And so we order them and then they say they're out of stock, which they're not. But, um, and so if you notice that wig types is longer to get their stuff up on their site, it's because they wait until they actually have them in their hand. So thank you, wig types. I feel like that's a better way to do it because I order from these sites and then they're like, oh, I don't have it. And then I didn't order it from a site that actually has it. And then by the time I do, they're out of stock. So it's, it's a little shady. Um, I get it, but you know, Anyways, let's um, let's get her out of the package and see what she looks like. All right, all right. Here is the card, and the other side is pretty much the same thing. Um, it does say that it is high heat safe up to four hundred degrees. Finish length is thirteen inches. Okay, they told us the length. Woo. <laughs> what else? That's it. Seduction Rose Signature Wig. And here she is in her glory. She's really pretty. She's basically like a sunset. Like um, these companies. So <laughs> in working with suppliers, you guys, I am coming to realize there are only a few suppliers for all of these hair companies. Um, but if you notice, this is a really familiar com color combination. Um, I think... Was it Alaskan Sunset? And then Vivica Fox has this color combo. So look, it's a whole thing, you guys. It's a whole thing. But there are rules to us regular people being able to purchase the same things as the manufacturers. There's like, it seems like there's like a time limit or you can have them custom made but there are rules around it, so. Um, oh, I gotta show you the inside of the cap, yeah? Yeah, yeah, it's a light cap, and it is a closed cap. Um, there are, oh, no combs. No combs, which is fine. Um, there are elastic adjusters, though, if I can get my fingers in there. Can't, okay, but you see them, elastic adjusters. So... You will need something to keep it on your head. Now, let's see. I'm, I'm not going to put a wig cap on, um, and I'm going to see if we need to. How about that? I do have my hair in a little baby ponytail in the back. Oh, she's super cute. Super cute. Yeah, I made that noise. What? <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. She requires spray or something. Um, I do have the thicker, so if I didn't want to, um, I would probably usually put this on, which is the serum instead of the spray for Simply Styling, but I don't want to get it all over my hands because I'm not near a sink right now. So. But she is that, you know, a little bit, it's like the Outre Scorpios and Geminis and what were all those, all those different, Leo Virgo, where it's like kind of like frizzy out of the package. And I wish I would have had this spray then. <laughs> because it just, 
makes all the difference in the world. All of it. Now on these, I do find I have to use more, but this stuff goes a long way. So, And if you uh, want to purchase it, I do have it on my site for sale. And right now, until the 16th of May, I am having a sale on my site, 20% off in honor of mothers everywhere. Um, so it's 20% off, uh, with code mom 20. Um, and to get that, that discount, you basically just, uh, go through the checkout, the like go to checkout. And I think it's when it comes to shipping, the shipping part that it gives you the option for that discount. So put that in there, mom 20, 20% off everything. Um, so first let's test the big head friendliness before I go any further. So she comes past my eyebrows, um, which is big head friendly ish. You know, it is, uh, it's big head friendly. Mostly <laughs> there's what I'm saying that because there's room in there, but the way that these are, so sometimes you have, you know, a, they, they make the bangs longer. Let me slow down my ADHD brain. Um, they make the bangs longer because everybody's head is sized differently and shaped differently. And so obviously it's easier to cut bangs off than you can't add more bangs to it. Right? So they try to leave them long and so you can cut them. However, when you cut them short on these type of wigs, that's a weird, huh? Got curled too high up. Um, so that when you cut them, then it looks weird, you know, like the bangs are like only like two inches long or whatever. Um, but where I was going with this is with these caps, you can't, you can only like have it back so far before it starts to show. Now these are way thicker bangs. So you have some leeway, like if you have a larger head with bangs um, technically most wigs are big head friendly cause you can just pull it back. You can put a wig grip on and it'll still keep it on your head even when it's pulled back. Um, and with these, the benefit or, you know, the benefit of them having thick bangs versus some of the other wigs is that you can do that. And then you're like, you can't see my hairline. So technically it is big head friendly. Technically. So, and I honestly don't usually cut my bangs of my wigs. I usually just do this. I usually just pull it back. Now, sometimes that won't work when you have a smaller head because a lot of times it'll get this like egg head thing going on and then it looks super obvious that you have a wig on and that's not what we want. I mean, with this color, I don't think anyone's going to think this is my hair, but trust me when I say people have thought all types of stuff is my hair when I was like, really? Now the only downside is if you move it while you're out or the wind blows, you know, so you can cut it. You can cut the bangs. The downside to that with these, and this is why I don't usually cut them is that then you lose this color. So like if I, cut, if I pull it down to where my hairline is, I can't see now <laughs> and I cut the bangs here, I've now lost all that pink and purple. So I usually just pull it back like that. When I had a shaved head, it was fine. <laughs> it was fine. Um, you can also put them like that if you want. That's actually kind of cute with the blue under. That's kind of cute. Um, okay. So you can see the difference between the sprayed side, it like makes the colors pop and then it gives it like that perfect, uh, healthy hair shine, not like a wiggy shine versus this side where it's still kind of dull and it's a little frizzy. So and again, I feel like with these wigs, with these special colors of like this, it needs more spray cause it's just super frizzy. So and you can brush through it. I don't brush through these ones that are like a wavy crimp because 
like it just tends up tends to end up making them more frizzy but it's up to you so she's stupid cute she is textured soft um obviously there's no parting space you can do like a root touch up thing and try to make a you know a dark root right here it actually would probably work really good but then it would take away the white so I'm just gonna leave it I think the white looks good but maybe I will try to give it a dark root let's let me think on that <laughs> um, so 13 inches it's super light which I expected it to be super light I just mirrored all my stuff super super light super light and super cute um, I'm sure the straight one of this is probably gorgeous again I don't have that one because they were out um, let's do a 360 and then I want to see this lovely lady it reminds me of um, the Zuri Sis tie-dye plum it's not as dark a purple but it's like similar color combo so Let's do a 360 of this baby, and then we will look at this one. Ooh, that sugar sweet, you got what I need. Sipping on the potion, all that kind of potion. Just my kind of heat, keep it on repeat. Tested by the potion, love it, this the potion. Okay, so I went back and looked at the 360 and saw that you can see the cap underneath. So I took my, um, I had like a ponytail uh, back there that sticks out. And so it sometimes it makes the cap and the wefts show uh, more than if my, head, my hair was flat. Um, so I took that out, put a wig cap on and did another 360. Um, it's still showing. So... It's not showing as bad, so just make sure that you get your hair as flat as possible in the back um, and know that the wig cap is probably going to show through, which kind of sucks. But again, I don't think that when you're wearing this color hair in this style, people really think it's your hair. So, I'm, you know, so <laughs> let's take a look at her. And this is OBB Pink Purple. She looks like she's going to be gorgeous. Let's get her out and see. Okay. <laughs> Here's the card for this one. And here's what she looks like. She's so pretty. Wow. I like this one better, but that's just me. Or it might not be just me. This one does have a darker cap. I get what they were trying to do because that has white, but like, I don't know, just, uh, also no combs, but does have elastic adjusters. So let's get this lovely laid out on my head, on my head. Wow. Oh my gosh. I love her. <laughs> And somehow, for some reason, she's softer, like much softer. I don't know why I say for some reason, because um, usually those the white is more straw-y. That's what I call it, straw-y. <laughs> straw-y. <laughs> it still needs product because it's a little frizzy and what have you, but oh, you guys. Holy potato butts. Okay. New favorite. Oh. 
Um, yes, please. I'm going to comb through this one ever so slightly. Ever so slightly, just to get her a little more polished. Oh my god. You guys, I don't have words because I'm like in love. I'm in love. Now I need to go find this in the straight. <laughs> See if any other sites have it up yet. And I wish I could order. So if you guys don't know, some of these manufacturers require that you have a brick and mortar store in order to sell them. So you can't just sell them, you know, order them and sell them on your website. I don't have a brick and, brick and mortar store yet. So yet. Um, dude. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> look at this. And this is 26 bucks. What? Honey. Um, Elena, Pink Unicorn. I know for a fact you guys will both like this. And there are others of you that will like it, but I'm not 100% sure that you will. I know those two well, <laughs> for sure. Um, let's get a 360 and see what the back of this one looks like. And then we'll do final thoughts. I don't have, I'm going to go order another one because when this one dies, I need another one. <laughs> That's how much I like it. Okay. Okay, so that was the 360. I'm in love with especially this one. The other one's cute, but this one is just like fire. Not actual fire, but like... <laughs> I want to wear this everywhere. 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 Okay. <laughs> Let's do final thoughts. Yes. Um... Okay, so I'm looking at my list of, of things I need to tell y'all. My ADHD brain. I am actually scheduled to see a psychiatrist to get back on ADHD meds because I'm like, deep, boop, bing, bong, bong, bing, bong. <laughs> so, um, Lazy Girl approved, 1,000%. Um, cap size, I will, I will pop it up on the screen, the actual size, but it is big head friendly. Um, it is, what did they say, 13, 13 inches? Yep, 13 inches finish length. Um, shedding, I only have like three hairs from both. So, and that's actually just the white one. I don't see any pink or purple hairs. So, shedding is minimal at, at worst. Uh, tangly, nope. Baby hairs, not applicable. Uh, there are no combs, but there are elastic adjusters. It doesn't, I have a small to average head and it doesn't feel like super loose. So, um, I do have a wig cap on right now, but when I didn't, it wasn't like, I didn't feel like it was going to fall off my head. Um, it is absolutely worth the money. It was twenty six eighty eight. dollars I'd pay more. I'd pay forty six eighty eight for this. Okay. Uh, probably more than that just cause it's so unique and so freaking gorgeous. So freaking gorgeous. What is that? That's a weird. Now, keep in mind, these are full caps that aren't, you know, they're not meant to be the highest quality. However, love it. Um, it is the density. Well, the density is light. It's definitely uh, th on the thinner side, but it looks realistic because of that. Like, it, it could, somebody could say could think this is your hair. The only thing that makes it not so much is obviously this. There's like no parting space or what have you. So 
there's that. But again, with these colors, I'm not really trying to make people think it's my hair. Um, it does need product. It is a bit like frizzy out of the package, but these special color wigs in this quality, especially this, this price range, they usually do need some product. So I would recommend, um, either the spray or the, uh, serum that is thicker. This, you know, you just put a little drop in your hand and rub it through and that's plenty. It's like coconut oil basically, but it's way better at doing what it does because it is uh, silicone based. So there's a whole thing around like why that works because these are the way they are, the fibers and et cetera, et cetera. So, um, you can get both of those on my site to lazygirlapproved.com. Um, if you are not already subscribed to me, please do. If you are, thank you so very much. Still on the road to a thousand. Um, this is a pretty small niche for special colors. So it's, it's been a struggle getting there. Um, if you guys don't know, I pay for all these wigs myself. Um, and I did, I did start a wig business. So lazygirlapproved.com. Um, to sell wigs and the goal is there's a couple goals one I want people to be able to find affordable special color wigs some of them are on the the I think the most expensive on my site is like 79 bucks but that's like a frontal so I'm trying to you know wig prices are ridiculous in some of the markets um, especially special color wigs so I'm trying to give you guys options for special color wigs that aren't just absolutely outrageous. I also am trying to help with along with so many other of you to normalize wig wearing, right? Take away the stigma. Wigs should be like an accessory to me. That's that's in my opinion. It should be it shouldn't be like are you wearing a wig or somebody's talking crap or you're worried about if somebody who cares? We should be able to wear whatever hair we want. Period. Period. Dudes wear hats, we're wearing wigs, okay? Okay. Um, <laughs> so now that I've rambled on and on, um, thank you, as usual, for hanging with me, hanging out with me, and spending time with me. And I'm going to go get to a bunch of these other reviews that I have. I have Babe in, um, it is the same uh, manufacturer, uh, and the style is called Babe, and it is FH Royal Purple, I think, something like that. So I haven't seen what that looks like in person yet. So I'm excited for that. Um, I do have Sammy in the green rainbow and the pastel rainbow. So I'm going to record that. What else? I got like a ton. I got a ton. So I'll see you guys soon. <laughs> I hope you guys have an amazing, amazing Mother's Day. Bye, guys. Ooh, that sugar sweet. You got what I